Welcome to our tour of Hotel Gold River at Port Aventura World in Spain. We'll show you the two bedroom family standard room on the resort's main street. We'll walk you through the resort's Sullivan City area, giving you our take on the hotel, its different food options, the vibe and the facilities available. And make sure you listen out for the information that might make you consider a different Port Aventura World Hotel. So this is the way out to the port? Yeah. Get in, Mum! Break, break, break! Oh, bye! Let's go and have a look at 3421. That's one. Yeah. Are we definitely in the right one? 3421, there you go. Yeah, we've got the right hand around. Yeah. Oh, wow, we've got the other door, guys. Oh, we've got a roller coaster view. Oh, yay! Have you looked out the window, Al? No, I have chance. We've got a roller coaster view. Yes, I do. I like the cowboy styling with the like metal bed frames and stuff. I know, it is really nice and really well done. Nice big room. I'm surprised they have more my bed sheets than you think. <laughs> full of hearts. Oh, I like this. Yeah. Nice little kitchen area. So where is the... Uh, That's the fridge, is it? Not sure how you're going to fit on that bed underneath though. Just you just get sandwiched in between. The rooms are really well laid out, with an entrance from both the main bedroom and the living area, and with a proper lockable door between those areas, complete privacy is assured. Oh, oh, get your feet up. This yeah, is I know it's really nice. No, this is a lot more. Uh, this isn't the hardest one. But, he's great. Oh, oh, this is. Oh, oh. Yeah, give me a second and we'll go. Is that nice? Theme park noise. Oh, and of course, and they're cool. Theme park view. No, there's nothing so cool. Imagine how much the theme it's park view would cost you. What a roller coaster, not No, yeah, you imagine how much you pay for this room in Disney. Yeah. It's home for a few days. It's just lovely. So well set out. What have we got in here? Toilet, obviously. Hi. And um, sink, obviously. Again, shower and bath. Towels, not very many there. Um, and we've got top shampoo and shower towel. And top hand wash. <laughs> so we've got that one opens on that side, and the other one opens at the other end. Ooh. Ah, so we have got extra pillows and a safe, and how to program the safe. Just look at this view. I mean, pretty impressive. Look at that. Superb. So this is the way out to the pool. Before we go any further, if you found this video helpful so far, I'd really appreciate it if you could tap the like button to let YouTube know that others might find it useful too. And it means a lot to us too, so thank you.
three freshwater pools, including a children's pool, are set beautifully over three levels. Florida Mall. Yep, so far so good. The City Hall, where reception is located, is the building you enter on arrival from the car park. Staff speak good English in case you're not confident conversing in Spanish. There's a shop where you can also have in park purchases delivered to during your stay. And there's the lobby bar opening out onto the beautiful main plaza. If you're flagging in the heat, the river bar, accessible from the pool area and Main Street, serves bar snacks and drinks. Although we stayed without adding a food option, you can choose to stay bed and breakfast, half board with dinner, or full board which includes lunch as well. Grand Hall Buffet is open in City Hall daily for breakfast and dinner, with the expectation that you'll be in one of the parks at lunchtime. You don't have to eat dinner at Grand Hall Buffet each night though, and can instead opt for the a la carte restaurant, Opera, which unfortunately wasn't open during our stay in August 2021. Or you can swap with a buffet at a different hotel in the resort. If you stayed here before, did you opt for one of the dining packages? And if you did, what did you think to it? Let us know in the comments section below if you think we should do this in the future. Mansi Andalusi is a five-star hotel with its own pools, restaurants and bars. As with all hotel rates at Port Aventura World, unlimited access to Port Aventura Park is included, but here, unlimited access to Ferrari Land is included too. At all the other hotels, access there is only for one day during your stay. And as if that wasn't enough, you also get express passes for the duration of your stay. Such a highly themed resort, rivaling Disney's resorts. There are photo opportunities at every turn. Entry to the theme parks is via your hotel room key, and there's a special entrance directly from the far west town of Sullivan City. How is loving that girl? <laughs> I can tell. <laughs> the nightly entertainment while we were there took place on a stage in the plaza, with kids playing friendly international football matches alongside musical statues with Woody Woodpecker. Though quite where they get their energy from after a long day at theme parks, I have no idea. here if you'd like to check out our Port Aventura Park and Ferrari Land vlogs for more tips and information.